We have a fishing warning heading into the weekend. The Utah Division of Wildlife Resources say if you fish illegally, you could run the risk of being busted. And this warning comes after a big 4th of July weekend bust. ABC4's Jason Wynn has more on the issue wildlife officials say is becoming quite a problem. Conservation officers say it may be a good time to check out the Utah Fishing 2019 guidebook and its regulations because if you're caught illegally taking fish from one of Utah's bodies of water, well, you may actually be hurting the natural habitat. Get ready to see more DWR checkpoints approved by local judges across the state to protect Utah's fish. If people been involved in the hunting or fishing activities, they're required to stop and it's signed by a judge. And when the people stop in, we will go through and check their compliance. Last Sunday, conservation officers did a checkpoint at Strawberry Reservoir. At the checkpoint, 254 vehicles were stopped, 300 citations were issued, and 47 illegal fish were taken, most believed to be Utah's cutthroat trout. The majority of the violations were fish that were within that 15 to 22 inch that are restricted. They were taken away. Another group of fish were taken away because they were filleted, and they're not supposed to be filleted at the reservoir. Officers say if you fillet a fish, then they can't identify what type of fish it is. DWR says if you take illegal fish at Strawberry, it will cost hundreds in fines, and an undesirable Utah chub population will grow. And once their populations get up so high, the other fish, the cutthroat and the rainbows, can't compete with them for a food source. So the management was to have the fisheries for larger cutthroat that can harvest those fish themselves and keep their populations in check. Those 47 fish were taken to a food bank in Heber City. I'm Jason Wynn in downtown Salt Lake, ABC4 News.